You think you have a glorious mullet? You filthy peasants are so wrong. Let's cut right to the cheese. I'm gonna show you how to get a lengthy, girthy, shiny mullet. Only 69, 69. For 69 months, you're gonna get this lineup right here. And I'm gonna show you how to get a racing mullet that's high performance, that you can use on a day-to-day -day basis. It's reliable, it's uh, comforting for your woman, not for other men. Take us through some of those products, I guess. First of all, we're gonna start with the Coors Mullet. This is specially handcrafted for me. They make like 50 barrels for me a year. That's, a, that's legit. Coors Mountains. Now that we're past all that, let's actually get to the products. You got your mullet starting fluid. This is what you're gonna wanna start with. But you just have a dry scalp. Um, quit using that fucking shit to get rid of that dry scalp. You need to start a mullet. After your starting mullet, you've got your mullet fluid. You're gonna need to use this on a day-to-day -day basis to keep that mullet going. You're gonna need to keep it, that mullet flowing. Formula K2 Racing Mullet. That's real shit right there. High RPM. Oh, dude, this mullet will go fast. You've got your Camaro. All sorts of two strokes with over 500 cc's. You're gonna need this if you're going that fast. Here's your second day's trial. Now we need the bold, the bold mullet oil. This is not just bold oil, so don't try to make it at home. This is, this is the real deal, guys. And after you're running all this high performance stuff, you're gonna need a heavy duty performance mullet oil. This is 80 weight 90. This ain't no light shit. This is heavy oil, guys. And it says not for trans on there. You heard him right. If I see a trans using this, I will personally come to your house and crash, crack a cougar's can on your head. Full one. On to the mullet pre-diluted coolant. This is pre-stoned, guys. It's already been stoned for you. You ain't got to do it. You probably will. Listen, we need this Silkaline Pro 2 Mullet Oil. A badass mullet. Way better than Dale D'Antoni's bullshit. This is real. Mystery Mullet Oil. Look at that. You need this for all of this that we're running. This is going to wash away and cleanse all your sins, boys. If you don't want to go with a, a special color, you're going to want to get this mullet coating. This is going to be so shiny, you don't even understand. It's going to smell like cherries. This is Rolo. This is one of our very satisfied customers. This is what she brought with her in her travel purse. This is the SC1 mullet coating. This is so shiny. Do you see the shimmer? Look at that. She's just so relaxed. It also has mineral vitamins and oils in it. Mullet grain wood stain. You want your hair looking like some wood? I do. I want to look like red chestnut. That's nice. Why don't you come here and tell everybody about uh, the product you've been using? Come here. Come here, here. Well, this is Henry, another one of our very satisfied customers. As you can see, he's been using the wood grain mullet stain. And, oh my God, it's beautiful. Look at this. Look at him. He's just, he doesn't even know what to think of life. He's so confident. Look at these curls. You can see he's also been using the, uh, the drill. You know, he's just become to be a better dog and a better good boy. Oh, he gets bitches all day. Look at that. You think he don't fuck? He's fucking. All right, guys. This right here, this is what it all, this is basically the whole kit right here. This mullet animal is NASCAR. This is a. This is how you get a NASCAR mullet. A NASCAR mullet? This is how you fucking do it. That's what you're buying right there. This is all you're buying. We've also got our mullet paint and primer. If you don't like the color of your stupid ass dirty hair, you can paint it. After you get all these paints, you're gonna want some polish. Mullet polishing compound, this is the way to go. You're gonna need this. It comes in the kit. Also, for those who have some super thick, nasty, shitty, dingleberry mullet hair, you're gonna want this mullet thinner. It's gonna get everything out without our, uh, Without our brush, I don't know where it's at right now. It doesn't come in the kit. This, you're gonna use too much of it, I already know. So you're gonna need to also get the mullet weld. This is how you get that shit back put into your hair after it falls out. Get it out the drain. Get your wife's hair out the drain. You're gonna add it. This is basically extensions. This is high quality technology produced from the aliens, seriously. They brought this down to us and they were like, look, y'all's mullets aren't good enough. This is why we haven't picked y'all up. Look, after all these products, you're gonna need a cleaner. 
This is the simple mullet, all mullet cleaner. It don't matter if you got a stupid mullet, shitty mullet, white trash mullet, high class mullet, super high up class mullet, you need this cleaner. So we got mullet, multi-duty complex grease. This shit is gonna make your mullet hold when you're going fast. You're gonna need to use this right after though, the mullet degreaser, cause let's let's face it, that shit's heavy, and when you start getting a nice long flowing mullet, that shit's got that's a lot of surface area. You're gonna want to degrease it. Well, Blake, why don't you let the viewers know what you have for them? Well, we've already talked about all the other fine products. Now let's talk about some of the tools needed. You really use a blow dryer? No. I go to get this porter cable, go down to Harbor Freight, and get you heat gun. Just don't get it too close to your scalp, or it's pretty hot and uh, it'll dry your, your mullet off real quick. Just don't get too close. Still got our mullet gauge. Now, this is just a trap on where you should be. If you achieve 836 coors, you could be way up here if you did it in a matter of one hour. As you can see, I'm off the fucking charts, boys. This works. This is a curler. See that? That's, it's got different speeds. You see how I made those curls? See that? You've also got your mullet gauge. It's very accurate. Put mine in. What's that? That's the highest achievement you can get in mullet. 69%. A hundred's just stupid. It's like... Right now, I'm just measuring the uh, the mullet strength. It's at 69%. She's doing it in record time. That's just what's crazy about all of this. This is for thinning your mullet out. Sometimes it gets a little thick. You get dingleberries in it. it might be hanging down so low that it touch your ass crack while you're taking poopsies. But you're gonna wanna let it dry, and then you're gonna wanna get it out. You also got your brush, heavy duty brush. This ain't no stupid bullshit. That's made out of gold, fellas. Off. It doesn't hurt. It doesn't take out any hairs. I know it's not long enough for you yet. How'd you even get it so matted up already? We haven't even written yet. Now you got your mullet gauge. Mind you, this goes up 200 feet. Yes, there are mullets that big. Yes, you will achieve a mullet this big with this kit. How much travel you have depending on how much wind. We just need to take a couple more. Wow, you're making some great improvement. You've also got your mullet almoner. This tells you your girth of your mullet. Hmm. We just need to take some measurements. That's looking good. Look, we're reading, we're, we're reading 69 microns. That's perfect. This is a perfect main and uh, you can tell she just loves her life now. Look at this. Results may vary. Now, these are not heavy duty. These are not for cutting a bunch of hair. These are just for just a little snip and a little trim. These are the travel compact size. Yes, they are. Weighing in at only 7.8 pounds. After all these products, you're gonna look in the mirror and you are gonna just shit yourself. This is the final product and it's our special made butt plug just for you. This is gonna help you not shit yourself and you're gonna pull it out and after you see that mullet and you're gonna be like, thank God they threw in this mullet butt plug. Come here, come here. <laughs>